I play Nate, who is a government operative. He's sort of fallen from grace early in his career from Russia, but he's given a second shot to make contact with Jennifer's character, who's sent out into the field to get him and extract the name of his operative. Have dinner with me. Are we going to become friends? Nate finds himself falling for Jennifer's character. When you start to cross over into the area of feeling, can you trust that is what you're receiving honest or is it just part of the game to get what she wants? She's a sparrow. There's something else we're not seeing. Something's really inherently psychologically dangerous about the whole story and the whole world. There's something very satisfying about that. Hey, Vale here with some cool movie facts on the efforts some actors go to to create the characters they play. For the role of Roger Kint, Kevin Spacey glued his fingers together in the film The Usual Suspects to give his left hand the feeling of paralysis. To prepare for his role in the film The Mask of Zorro, Antonio Banderas practiced with the Olympic fencing team in Spain for four months. Natalie Portman, for the role as Nina Sayers in Black Swan, trained with former New York City ballet dancer Mary Helen Bowers for up to eight hours a day, six days a week for over a year ahead of shooting the film. Adrian Brody, for his role in The Pianist, gave up his apartment, sold his car and moved to Europe with only two bags, so he could get familiar with his character's discomfort. He also went on a crash diet and lost 30 pounds in six weeks, weighing 130 pounds at his lightest during shooting. Whoa. Okay, so if you want to watch more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you receive the videos the moment they are online. Bye bye.